These things are dangerous. I'm Dan Jason, this is Concepts in the Wild. And anyone who's ever touched a lily knows that these little things up here, the anthers, they stain everything. They get into your skin, they get onto your fabrics, and they just don't come out. And the science behind how this works is amazing. If you look at them under a microscope, the pollen grains are spiky. They're kind of like Velcro. They have little ridges and they get stuck inside the fibers of anything they touch and they cling on mechanically. So it's not like you can just wash them away. They're literally gripping like Velcro. And they use this to grip onto the little hairs of the pollinators like bees that touch them. Make sure to hold really tight so that they don't just kind of brush and fall off. They could be carried by the bee to the next flower. And at the same time, this they have this bright orange color, which is made up of pigments called carotenoids. And carotenoids are oil soluble, so they will get onto the oils of animals that brush past them, and of course, onto the skins of humans that touch them. And this is an amazing evolutionary adaptation because not only does it allow them to be carried different places using this vice-like Velcro grip, they're brightly colored. And this is what attracts the bees to the flower. Flowers are the bright colors that they are because pollinators love contrast. And this is the most contrasted part of the whole flower. So it's the one that the bee is most likely to touch and brush as it finds the nectar. And at the same time, they're also a warning to predators. The carotenoids have a very distinct flavor that animals don't like. They kind of taste poisonous. So by associating the bright color with the taste that these animals might encounter when they eat them, the animals become conditioned not to go after these flowers, which allows them to survive long enough for the bees to get to them and to carry their pollen around and make more of these beautiful flowers. I just thought that was amazing. I had to share. Uh, I'm Dan Jason. This is Concepts in the Wild. Subscribe for more.